What's up, guys? I hope everything is going well. Welcome back to Roche Kilian Uncut. This is the podcast where I share, you know, a few thoughts and I share things about fitness, about nutrition, and about mental health. That's basically how I started my channel three and a half years ago. So I don't really want to lose that fact. Yes, I am doing daily vlogs and I'm basically doing pretty well. I mean, I think I'm on 50 vlogs daily. That's 50 days of daily vlogging. And um, I have kind of lost track of, you know, a reason why I started this channel, which is obviously your, you know, mental health and the fitness side and obviously the nutrition as well. So today in this podcast, I basically just want to just want to kind of talk about the whole, you know, daily vlogging and also something that I have started that you potentially know about if you are subscribed to my channel and that is the daily videos or the 365 day challenge that I set for myself basically going to the gym every single day and transforming my body into something you know that I've never seen before now I can show you the results and I can tell you as well that in the last I think I'm on day 145 147 maybe and I have gained from about 98 all the way to 107 so what is that that's nine kilograms I mean that's a lot of weight to gain in those days 147 days so I am done I'm done with that now so I'm moving on to a little mini cut phase because there's still (laughs) well over 200 days left so there's time for a little cut maybe like a three four week cut just to kind of like level things out because I do feel like I'm getting a bit chubby in the face. And then from there, I am going to bulk up a little bit more, see how far I can go until there's about 90 days left. Um, So basically when I reach about 270, and when I reach 270, I'm going to go on a nice, decent cut to really take everything that I worked for in those days and uh, squeeze it into like a really nice ripping session. Or basically to see how my physique ends up. So, you know, the reason for the podcast is to explain or give you some insights of this. You know, if you are thinking of maybe doing a 365 day yourself, maybe you just want to do a 90 day, maybe you want to bulk, maybe you want to cut. Whenever, whatever the question is or whatever you want to do, let me tell you one thing about it. It is definitely something that you need to think about before you do. You can't just decide, like, you know what, I'm going to do 365 days. Because we don't realize how long that is. If you think about, just think about a year ago, exactly today, a year ago, where were you? You were potentially you were in a previous job. You maybe just had a baby, you know, you potentially just, I don't know, got a new job. All those type of things happened a year ago. And to you, it feels freaking long ago. Like it feels massively long. Like, like, I mean... You can't even comprehend how long a year actually is. And especially, you know, you've, well, people have said, like, you shouldn't look at the watch. Like, especially if you're in a hurry, don't look at the watch because it's going to take forever. Like every tick, you're going to see the tick goes down and down and tick, tick, tick. And it just feels like that cursor is never moving. But when you're busy and you're doing things, then, you know, before you know it, it's like 2 p.m. and you, you can go. So that's exactly what happens when you do a daily challenge like that, especially something massive like 365. You start off very confidently. And then after like, I would say 20 days, 21, maybe even 40 days, if you're lucky, you it starts to seep in. It starts to seep in that a month and a half has just passed. It felt like a lifetime. Things happen in your life. People come, people go, you know, like I said, you maybe got a new job. Maybe there was a baby, something, things happen. And then you realize like a whole month has passed and you're only on 40. There's still 220 days left. No, 320 days left. You want to see how you understand what I mean? So it needs to be something that you that you honestly make a decision prior and you think about it and you plan it and you make sure like, listen, like, of course, you can't plan life. Anything can happen in a year. So many things I'm causing injuries, you know, family upsets, financial things like so many things but if you can control like if you can get your mindset right to kind of prepare yourself so that when something happens let's say you know there is a financial struggle or maybe someone gets sick or you get injured how can you handle that can you handle it and how can you then basically go through it so i just wanted to kind of like i said not warn you 
just give you a little insight of of the 365 days or a challenge like that. So if you are always, or if you are keen to start it, just know that you know, I want you to think about it before. And I'm not discouraging you. I want you to do this because I know that if you do, you will get great results. I myself already feel the change. It's amazing. Like my life is changing, you know? It, it creates discipline. It's, it's just a beautiful thing. So I encourage you to do it for sure. I do encourage you to do it. But one thing I can say is it's not gonna be easy but I want you to do it so that you can experience how tough it is. And if you get through it, you're going to be a different person, for sure. All right. I just wanted to leave you with that. Um, of course, if you like these podcasts, if you also like my daily vlogs, please like and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one. Cheers.